When? So here we are, uh, this is the family man. This is my daughter, Chloe, and Taylor's behind the camera. So right here we're doing ear candling. So what this does, you probably already know, but my little girl, this is the first time she's ever had this done. She has a little bit of water in her ears from swimming. She has a little bit of wax there. She can't hear properly sometimes. So we use these. And what this is doing is we set fire to it and the flame creates a funnel sucking sort of action. And it sucks everything naturally out of the ear instead of having to use chemicals or eardrops. This is a natural way of doing it. A lot gentler on the skin or a lot gentler on the person. Doesn't hurt. Um, it's quite fun to watch, quite fun to do. And um, it's just, yeah, generally I think natural therapies can be a lot better than uh, using traditional medicines. Uh, I believe that putting things in your ears that, you know, the drops or anything from pharmacies, you, you don't know what it's got in it. Um, this is, you know, a, a very simple, natural way used by the Chinese for you know, probably hundreds of thousands of years. Um, anyway, so yeah, ear candling. Um, my little girl's 10 and my little boy's 8 and he's about to get it done next. So um, you can buy them from most health stores. Um, some pharmacies do sell them I think, but um, um, here on the coast, uh, Nurture or Coastal Wellbeing is the best place to get them. And um, yeah, they're great. They work really, really well. For adults, they're even better because adults get a lot of build up in their ears, um, more than what children do. And I, I use them all the time. They work really well. And um, like I said, as I said before, it doesn't hurt and it's natural. So, ear candling. Thanks for listening. And hit subscribe. Come and see us. Follow what we do. We love uh, entertaining you guys. Chloe and Taylor's Adventures. And this is The Family Man signing off. See you later.